Welcome back, guys. You are just in time to see me put the route in for our first kind of major piece of uh, the London Underground. So, uh, this is Wimbledon over here. And why isn't the why isn't the Metro line tool working? Or is it? And it's just me. Is it like you're not doing anything? Because because <laughs> that's not a blooming. Yes, it is. Hang on. Where's the where's the there it is. Couldn't find the darn thing. So, right, it goes up here. So, this is Wimbledon. Let me just quickly show you. So, we're, we're down in Wimbledon. And we go up to... Uh, this is uh, Wimbledon Park, I think. This is, is this Wimbledon Park? Yeah, Wimbledon Park. And then we're up to Southfields. And then up to East Putney. And then across the river. Which should be this blooming bridge. Uh, so, we're up to Putney Bridge. Then Parsons Green, wonderful Parsons Green, and then Fulham Broadway, and then... Uh, now, <laughs> you guys were as bloomin' useless as you always are when I ask you a question. Half of you said, put all the stations in, and half of you said, don't put all the stations in. <sighs> like, what, like, how much use are you guys, really? Now, how the hell do I add this stop onto here? Uh... Now, ha, I may need another mod, and I've got a sneaking suspicion I need another mod. No, oh, I need the multi... I thought I had it. I thought I had the multi-platform mod, but apparently I don't. Okay, right, well, yeah, it is what it is. Uh, okay, right. So in that case, we'll just run it for now. We'll just run it back down here. It, it kind of doesn't matter too much at the moment. Um, but it will do fairly soon. So uh, back to East Putney and uh, Southfields and Wilburton Park and this. Right. Now I'm going to try and get a couple of things done. A couple of like fairly important things um, to kind of help me uh, develop kind of sort of the Southwest-ish. Uh, and then after this episode, I think we're going to have a, like a big change. And we're going to go north of the river. And we're going to... I think we're going to do Fulham, Chelsea, Westminster. Like developing up into... And then the West End. So that we kind of link this whole area to the City of London. We've got people using it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. It, you know, it's like... Oh, look at all the blooming people. This is Wimbledon, of course. And Wimbledon is a fairly major uh, junction. But see now people can get people can get from all over the place to all over the place. Look how damn busy it is. No passengers on this first one. But I think that's soon gonna change. What about this one? Oh see that brought a whole load of people. So it's all linking together. Well we're gonna continue that theme, guys. This this still got no people on it. But then, you know, it's only going to um, to put... And there's, like, no people over here. And there's no electricity either. But we're kind of not worried about that for now. Uh, I'm going to be... I, like I said, I'm going to be filling this area in. Right, uh, you know what? I need to get on, because otherwise we won't get anything done in this episode. And that's not good. So, uh, the two things we're going to do... We're going to try and put in the northern line... And we're going to try and put the number 57 bus route. Well, why the number 57 bus route? Well, the number 57 bus route runs from Kingston and links up... Uh, Wimbledon and a bunch of areas kind of along that northern line so it kind of is tying all of our transport networks together and should make them all work better so that's the plan let's do the tube first we'll do the tube first because that's going to add like a lot of the roads that we need for the bus and that'll work we're going to start off with uh, with South Wimbledon station which is down here now we've already got th that part we need to link this up to this part so we're going to take now, now this is going to be done with a four lane road because this is a f this is a four lane road Pre I'm like damn sure that this is a four lane road so we're going to take this across here and and up to there right and then we're going to change this so that this is this is all four lane going up here let's just run that bomb 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 all right cool so we've done that but now this is this is the now this is two lane. This is two lane. No question about that. But I'm thinking that this one down here. I'm thinking that this is four. 
So you know what? We're going to put in four on all of this. Boom. There we go. Right. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Okay, South Wimbledon. Whew, man, now this is going to be quicker than the last one because I'm not going to be telling you loads of details about every single spot that I put in. So, now South Wimbledon um, is going to be... Now, <clears throat> the only stop that's got like um, a, an, another one running, another tube connecting to it is um, Stockwell. So, the rest we can put in with single stations. So, we're going to start off with... Uh, with uh, Oh, Morden's actually the first one. I thought it was South Wimbledon. It's not Morden. Where's Morden? Uh, here's Morden. Ooh, we haven't put that bit in yet. Huh. Okay. Right, well, we've got a little bit of road to put in here. So we need to put in kind of a little bit of a... A sort of a kind of a tri triangle. Um, how about like... Kind of... Kind of that. It, yeah, that's... That's kind of sort of-ish, isn't it? Yeah, right, uh, and that's all we need because I'm just going to put the station in. I'll do, I'll do the other stuff like offline, because um, you just want to see the cool stuff. So more than station's going to go in. It's like at, the, at this end, so it's about there. Right, cool. Then we go up to South Wimbledon, right, which is on this corner, and it is on this corner, so it should be there. Boom. See? Much faster. Right, then we go up to Collier's Wood up here. Is that the next stop? I've got to check. Yep, Collier's Wood is the next stop. And we've already got the road in, because this is this is one of the main roads. It's the A24 going up here. And, yeah, it should just sit there. Right, cool. I'm going to pause this, because um, all of this is going to not have electricity and stuff. Uh, then, Tooting Broadway. Tooting Broadway. Now I've got to say that like this part that this is south this is like really south London and this area of like Tooting and whatever I don't know this area very well at all. Like the centre of London and the city and the southwest and parts of but even parts of North London I know but South London I really don't know that well. So um, now that's got a crossroads there and we want to be on the corner of the cross. You know what I'm going to put that in because that's kind of sort of important. Am I going to put this in with... I think this is going to be just an ordinary road. Yeah. Uh, so it's going to come... Uh, it wants to be at a slight angle. So it wants to be coming down there. All right, that'll do. So let's go back to our stations. And that's going to be... Well, that's as close as we can get. So there you go. We've got Tooting Broadway. Next one should be Tooting. Oh, is it Tooting Beck? Yep, it's Tooting Beck. Tooting Beck and then Balham. Now, Balham, I actually do know a tiny little bit because when, um, when I was doing some some work for... Hang on a second, let's, let's put this in. So that should go... It is right on the corner, so... There. When I was doing some work... You remember I told you I worked in Vauxhall for a little bit? Uh, up, um, up here. Where's Vauxhall? Here's Vauxhall. When I worked up here... In Vauxhall. Well, I actually stayed with the guy, uh, the, the son of the guy who owned the company, right? And he lived in Ballam, down here. So, um, but I've got to say, I, I don't know. It's funny, people in London are very much, like, like really loyal to the particular area that they're from. You know, like if, like if you like South London, then that's it. You like South London. You'd never think of living like in North London or West London or East London. Same as same as if you're a, if you're an East Ender. If you live in the East End of London, like over here, yeah, you'd never dream of living in the South West. And there's a big North South divide, right? Like if you're a, if you're North London, you would never live in South London. And if you're South London, you'd never live in North London. Very weird. You you watch the com like read the comments, and I bet you all the Londoners will agree with me about that. They'll, they'll be like, yeah, yeah, it really is like that. Don't know why. There's like no reason for it, but it just is. It's just one of those things. So where were we? Uh, we did Collier's Wood, Tooting, right, um, Tooting, Bet, Ballam, right? So, and we're just coming, as you can see, we're just coming up this road, which is the A, this is the A24, yeah, yeah, A24. Nobody calls it the A24. 
Um, so, yeah, let's drop this down so I can actually see. Now we... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's right next to the railway station. Now, we've, uh, we've got the railway, but we haven't got the railway station in. And we've got that tunnel underneath. So, you know what? It's going, like, as close as we can put it. So, we'll put it there. That'll do, pig. So, we've got Ballum. Then, uh, I'm pretty sure it's Clapham South next. Yeah, Clapham South, Clapham Common, Clapham North. So, Clapham South... This should be should be pretty easy. Um, now, where is it? Oh, it's this. Uh, yeah, it's here. It's on this corner here. Uh, I'm, I'm actually going to move it one square down just because it'll sit better. Right. So Clapham South and Clapham Common, which is up here. And yeah, you know what? There's actually a little funny bit of road here. The roads around here are like very funny. Trust me. Um, it, you know what? I'm going to put it there. I'm going to put it there. And it is what it is. So that's Clapham Common. Then Clapham North. Now where's Clapham North? Oh, there's Clapham North. Now that, I actually don't know like where that station is um i don't i for some reason i don't know this station so yeah now we've got we are going to have a train here i may actually put this like a tiny bit further up than it actually i might put it like there I, uh, I'm, I see I'm thinking about having this and this road coming off here and I'm thinking well this is going to have to be bridged but then like this train station is going to have to be further over and that's going to be blooming difficult so I, I think yeah I'm I'm going to take a liberty and I'm going to move this a little bit further up I'm going to put it there okay then Stockwell pretty sure Clapham let's see let's see uh, Clapham North then, yeah, then Stockwell. Now, Stockwell is the one that's got uh, the, the old crisscross going on. So, now, the question is, do I use, like, a... Uh, now, we'll use, we'll use this. We'll use this one. Yeah, 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 of course. That'll do. That'll do nicely. Right, so let's drop... Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. And we've got it in the right place and everything. Right. So, that's going to go there. Boom. Bingo. All righty. So, Stockwell, then the Oval. Now, this here, this is the Oval. This is the, the Oval Cricket Ground, which is um, very, very famous. When they have, um, when they have cricket, um, we call them tests, cricket tests. And when, when we have a series against Australia or India or Pakistan or whatever, um, they, used to play, they used to play either five or six tests. It's now, it's now pretty much always five tests. But the last test is always played at the Oval. And it's often very exciting, like the decider, you know, for who's going to win. Like when we play um, Australia, it's the Ashes series. Because um, with the first time that Australia beat England, like the first time ever in the history of the world, they um, they took the you know, like you put, if you know cricket the, there are stumps in the in the middle of the at, at each end of the what's called the wicket the Americans would be completely lost now like, what the hell is he talking about um, basically they they took the, the the wooden stumps and they burned them and there was a headline in the newspaper the death of English cricket and they put the ashes of these burned um, stumps it, it was actually the the bits that go on the top which are called the bales they burned them and they put them in this tiny little urn right like a, like a little fun miniature funeral urn and they put the ashes of the, the burnt uh, bales in there and that's the trophy that is used to this day uh, and it's called the ashes trophy uh, there you go and it was to signify the death of English cricket because oh my god we got beaten by the Australians and they've been kicking the crap out of us ever since Although I've got to say, just recently we've been doing pretty well against them. So, and there's a new uh, there's a new test which starts. Um, did it start actually? Did it start on Wednesday? I think it might have started this week. And I've, mi I've completely missed it because I've, I've been busy with this stuff. Because because um, I have no life. Right. So we're going back to this. So the oval. We'll put the oval in. And I need to actually find an asset. There is a cricket ground, but it's rubbish. So. 
Right, we're going to put it on. We'll, we'll put this on this corner there. Oh, uh, and it won't go in there. What? It'll go in there. So that that'll do. That'll do, pig. Um, so that's that. That's that. And then Kennington. Kennington's on this side, apparently, according to the map. I don't think it makes a whole hell of a lot of difference. But there's Kennington. I'm not going to talk about Kennington, because Kennington is a very, very boring place. If there's anybody who lives in Kennington who can tell me anything that's interesting about Kennington, please do, because I think Kennington is boring. There's nothing there. There's just nothing. There's like a bunch of houses, and that's it. There's nothing interesting about Kennington. Then, up past Kennington, we get the Elephant and Castle. Now, the Elephant and Castle... Uh, the Elephant is... Now, hang on. The, now, Kennington actually does branch off. There's a... There are two branches of the northern line. Now, one runs up here through Elephant and Castle, right? But there's another branch that runs off and goes to where? Um, oh, that goes to Waterloo. Oh, coolness. So, we actually need to put another... Well, actually, we could link it up to this end. And they could use the same platform as these guys. Oh, that works. We could just hook that up to that. That simplifies matters. Good. Right. Don't have to worry about that. Right. And then and then the, the, the one line goes through Waterloo and up this way. And then the other one goes through London Bridge, uh, which is which is here, and up this way. And then they kind of meet up in North London. So that's kind of what that does. Um, I put in Elephant Castle, didn't I? Please tell me I put in the Elephant Castle. Oh, God, no. So, yeah. Now, again, I'm not, like, I'm 100% sure on the location of the station. So I'm going to put it on this bit of road here. There. It It's close enough, I think. And then, that's it. We're, uh, we're up to London Bridge. Now, here's London Bridge. Now, we haven't done London Bridge yet. So, now, do I put in London Bridge Station? Would you like me to put London Bridge Station in? Yeah, I, I tell you what, we're not going to get to the Bloomin' 57 bus, are we? There's no way. Not in one episode. So, all right, we'll, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll put in London Bridge Station then. Seeing as we can't do the 57, we'll put this in. So, how the hell do we want to do this? We've got a road that runs along there. Oh, now, this is City Hall here. This is an awesome building. We're going to have to put that in fairly soon. Um, okay, so we've got... We've got a road that runs along here. And you know what? I'm just going to hook it up direct. Right, so how the hell are we going to do this? Um, now, London Bridge... Now, oh, I should mention, there is a line. Waterloo has another station called Waterloo East, which is kind of just like here. And if I bring up the map, you can probably see it. Here's Waterloo Station. Here's Waterloo East. And you can get a train from Waterloo East through to, um, to London Bridge. And that line actually runs across here into Charing Cross. And I, I'm kind of like wondering how the hell I can do that. I used to get the train into Waterloo, and frequently I used to get the the train from uh, from Waterloo East over to London Bridge, and then I sometimes I'd just walk over London Bridge and up here because um, I worked just up here, so it wasn't wasn't too far to walk. Uh, I'm stalling while I try and figure out what the hell I'm going to do. I'm going to put in one of these for now, like this. But I think what we're going to do is put in two of them. And I'm going to really try hard to do... I don't, I don't know what I can do about um, Waterloo East. But I'm certainly going to put Charing Cross in. Like, how can you not put Charing Cross in? That would just be ridiculous. So I'm going to try and put another... Start another road across here and have um, th this actually is not bad for London Bridge because it does have these things on the platforms or well, at least like, like from my memory it does so I'm wondering about putting another one in London Bridge is, is major uh, I'm, I'm, I'm faffing around guys but this is this is tricky stuff so where would I need it I'd need it well let's try like that and we'll see. This might look quite good. 
Or it might look blood and awful. We'll see. Actually, you know, I've got a sneaky suspicion that might look quite good. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. I quite like that. I tell you, I might put that. I might put something like that in for uh, for Clapham Junction. Now nah, we're going to do some bigger for Clapham Junction. Right. What the hell else are we going to do then? So we're going to put in the um, the tube now. Now that we've put those in, we can we can uh, put the tube in. So the, now London Bridge. Does London Bridge have multiple connections? Uh, it does have multiple connections because um, it's got the Jubilee line running through it, hasn't it? Yeah. Again, something that I should know because I used to catch the Jubilee line. For, like when I worked in Canary Wharf, I would catch the um, the train, uh, the the <laughs> the tube from Waterloo to Canary Wharf, which went through London Bridge. So in that case, London Bridge needs to go in as a four-way, um, and it's we should probably put it like somewhere like there. Let's bring the map up and have a quick check. It kind of doesn't matter because it's part of the whole station, but like that would kind of work if we put it there, and saves us a bit of space as well, which is not a bad thing. So we can have the northern line coming up here, and we can have the Jubilee line going through there. That is good. That is good. Right, man. Okay, so I need to hook that line up. Um, I'm, I'm going to try. And, oh, I'm going to try and do it now. I'm going to try and do it now. So, at least now we can get rid of the map. Look at all the blooming stations. Wow. All the people who said, "Well, I told him not to put the, all the stations in," they'll be upset now because I've put them all in. I'm just going to, you know, if, you, if you're one of the people that said put all the stations in, I'm going to get them to talk to you. Because you got me into this. You can get me out of it. Right, so we'll bend that round like that. And then like that. Then that one's nice and straight. I th you know, I'm going to use the straight tool for it. And then I'm going to use it for that one as well. And for this one, and yeah, yeah, that's, that angle's not too acute. This one we're going to change. This one we're going to do bendy. Have a bit of a Beckham on this one. Uh, so like that. There we go. And then, yeah, here was me thinking, oh yeah, you know, I'll put the northern line in, and then I'll put the number fifty-seven bus in. Pff, yeah, right. Oh man. Like however long I think that this is gonna take, it's gonna take about ten times longer. So we're up to what is that is that Kennington, I think, maybe? Then whatever the hell that was. Oh that, um yeah. That was um that was the oval. So this must be Kennington and then Am I gonna do that? I'm gonna do it bendy. I've got the stupid curve tool on, that's why. There we go. Elephant and Castle, and then finally, we come up here and into London Bridge. Right, we have got the Northern Line. Man, okay, I need to put the route in, we need to colour it. The Northern Line is black. Oh yeah, very dark. Um, so yeah, but that means we've got now got an alternative route in from uh, like and it's going to go through all here and by the time we add the buses and the tube and the trains together there's going to be like so much going on it's going to be crazy we'll call it there guys um, next episode yeah well next episode is going to be the 57 so we'll put the 57 in which is going to further develop this area around here and uh, and then we'll move up here and we'll do some like we'll fill in this area up here so man it's going to be a long series guys peace out